One of the, let's say, concerns about um, the uh, birth control pill has been what is its effect upon the uh, bacteria in the person taking it? And specifically, what might lasting effects be not only on the gut bacteria, but should that woman then decide to go off the pill, might there be an effect upon the, uh, the microbiome that lives within the birth canal, the bacteria that live within the birth canal? And I think some of that information, a lot of that information is still unknown. Uh, but there is now some data that's accumulating indicating that at least there are changes in the gut bacteria that may happen as a consequence of exposure to birth, con uh, birth control pills. So uh, we don't have all the answers as it relates to that. Uh, I would say that as a matter of recommendation that should a woman wish to become pregnant that I would allow a significant amount of time to elapse between the time of stopping the birth control and then uh, trying to become pregnant. Because you've got to understand that with birth uh, your baby will be inoculated by the bacteria living in the birth canal. That process puts bacteria into the baby's gut, basically through the nose and through the mouth, and uh, that is the first microbiome for that developing infant. We don't yet fully understand how that birth canal microbiome is changed by having been on uh, birth control pills previously.